close your eyes and watch your breath. Notice where you feel the breath as it comes in, where you feel it when it goes out. Start with a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths to make the sensation of breathing really obvious. And as long as deep and long is comfortable, stick with it. If it's not comfortable, you can change. Try to find a rhythm that feels good for the body right now. In other words, if you're feeling tired, what kind of breathing will energize you? If you're feeling tense, what kind of breathing will relax you? And then try to stay there with the breath, because what we're trying to do is watch the mind continually. Because we all know our minds in little bits and pieces. It's like a movie that is playing on the TV. You walk into the room for a few minutes, and then you walk out for a half an hour, and you come back in for a few more minutes, and walk out for another 15 minutes. You see little bits and snatches. But why they're running after each other, and who's the bad guy, and who's the good guy, sometimes you don't even know that much. So if you want to see what's going on in the mind, see who in the mind you can trust and who in the mind you can't trust, you've got to stay here for a while. Listen to the voices in your mind, but not believe them. So how do you listen but not believe? First, you've got to get, get a really good foundation here in the present moment. That's what the breath is for. You step out of the thoughts of the mind for a bit and just stay with the sensation of the breathing. As long as with, you're with the breathing, you know you're in the present moment. Because it is so easy when you're watching your thoughts to get pulled away with them and suddenly find yourself in the past and the future or off someplace else. But when you're with the breath, you know you're right here. And this is where you can stay to observe the movements of the mind. And you stay with the breath because it gives you a sense of well-being. And when you have that sense of well-being, it's a lot easier not to get pulled in by some of the tricks of the mind. And this way you begin to see which parts of the mind you can trust and which you can't which ones you want to develop, which ones you'd like to let go of. It's all for you to see right here, simply that you haven't been watching consistently enough. So that's what we're doing here, is learning how to stay here consistently. You're trying to make this practice timeless. As we go through the day, too many times we have, there's the time to meditate, and then there's the time to eat, and then there's the time to work, and then there's the time to whatever. But try to make it seamless, make it one big time, i.e. the time to be there right here in the present moment. when you're working with the breath or if you're beginning to observe the mind. Whatever stage you are in the practice, okay, it all becomes one seamless practice. So say that the Dharma is agaliko, it's timeless, and you want to make your practice timeless if you want to see some timeless truths. So try to stay here continually. If you find yourself wandering off, just come right back. Actually, you don't have to pull anything back if you wander off after a thought. Then as soon as you drop the thought, you're going to be right back here. So just keep dropping the thoughts, coming back, dropping the thoughts, coming back. Each time you come back, reward yourself with a really satisfying breath as a way of underscoring the fact that you really do want to stay here. And you want to stay here consistently so you can really gain knowledge for yourself. I mean, We can read in the books what the Buddha has to say about why we're suffering and what suffering is and how we can put an end to it. But for it to really work, you have to observe for yourself. You say, oh, I'm that movement of the mind, or this movement of the mind, that's what's adding unnecessary suffering and stress onto my life. And then you figure out how you can drop it. That's when you really see, and when you're seeing really does give results. <laughs>